Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, we will be looking at uh, lookup edits in Dev Express. Uh, just want to tell you, in Dev Express, lookup edit has a data source. We can bind uh, our data database, but in combo box edit in Dev Express, we don't have it. First, let's do lo move over our uh, lookup edit. And let's add a text edit. And let's add a simple button. And let's resize this one, maybe like this. Let's add another button. The size like this maybe is better. Now let's say we will say add or add cities. We will be adding cities here, but I will not create a database. I will just create a list. Then I will bind with my lookup edit. Btn add cities. And let's find an image for this one, something maybe is beautiful. Mm. Maybe this one. And let's name it the same. Takes the takes the cities, and here we we'll say takes the search and add. And now this one, let's say BTN search cities. And let's name it also search cities. And let's buy an icon for this one also. And let's add maybe this one. It's better maybe. We size it something like this. First, let's do something like this. We double click on add cities. We we'll write anything inside our any city name inside our text edit, and then it will be added inside lookup edit. Let's double click add cities. And we say text that. Uh, Cities. If you want to add from properties, we we'll add properties and from column, maybe no. See how we can add it. Mm. Let's do like this. Let's create a class and then I will say setting. I will set it public. Then let's say properties integer city id then string city name and let's create a list of this one 
Let me say bar list yeah. list city and then that's our say mail city ID let's say one and then city name let me just call Martin. Uh, not like this, sorry. Let's first declare it and then we say list. Add new city, and then I will say ID one. Oh, maybe we could do like this on it. Here we say new city. ID is one. And city name is Martin. And let's copy this one. We have say two and three. Let's say Berlin. Let's say Zurich. Yeah, just like this. Let's bind this one with our lookup edit. We say text uh, cities properties data source and then we will give our list. Now let's run it. And as you see, this empty. I say add cities. As you see, that we have three cities here. And the moment I choose, it gives us. Uh, like namespace uh, namespace name so uh, we can change this one we'll go from from display member i will write or well, maybe we can do from here maybe from here oh, sorry. from here i will write Text uh, cities properties display member it was city name and then value member properties value member it was our ID it was city ID and let's run it. Mm. Oh, sorry, <laughs> let's click add cities. As you see, that we have city ID and the city name, and we can choose it. Let's change when it, we focus these things, and uh, maybe I will like uh, make this icon is smaller, like six, 16 pixel. Let's go. It will save. Mm, well, then we can we can get it from here. Maybe not there. Add city, and then here, say, search maybe this one. something like this maybe now 
just run it and add it as you see that we have it uh, let's change this appearance when we focus it we say from properties focused and let's give this one right chair let's copy this one let's do the same for our text edit Let's close this one. I think now that's it is. Now it's better. And what we are going to do here, uh, this edit value. First we go for all properties. And then this null text we just remove this one now it's empty as it is and also I just want to click whenever I click I just want the first one like a margin to be selected here let's come here what we can do we say text as it is uh, properties oh, one minute. not this one item index maybe And then I say, let's try with zero. As you see, that margin selected. It starts from zero. And what we can do more? We want uh, whenever we write any city name in text edit, and we click our search cities and want our lookup edit to be selected let's do this one also let's double click this one and then we say text the cities mm. text maybe we we'll select text and then we write text the search and add and text let's add first then we want to select Berlin as you see Berlin is selected and maybe if there is other way beside this one takes the cities and edit value I think this is better if we use this one Next, uh, let's comment this one now let's run it add it and let's write Berlin mm -hmm. it didn't select There was one other way also selected, but I don't remember really. Properties. Um. Here I find a solution like this. For example, if we say Text the cities text and our search and add. Let's do first this one. If I say Berlin, search so as you see that is selected, but we don't have others because other is gone. I have to do like this, then it will be coming. So I try to find another solution for this one. Let's go on this one. 
first we will select and then second one we will get our ID it's just city ID we need it and then we'll uh, item index will set it as a, a zero the first one and third one because at its value it asks for our like uh, uh, ID not uh, not city name a city ID it asks then uh, I just uh, assign our city ID then it will be done I think let's run it actually I made a little bit complicated but it's just like Berlin as you see that Berlin selected and there is other also I can write margin hmm can become like before uh, because yeah we set this zero maybe you set to no or minus one let's try it like this say Berlin Berlin selected let's go for Martin Okay. Anyway, let's delete this one. I think <laughs> this is better, maybe. And now we did all. Now we can add our uh, our data from the database. Let's try this one. I right click here and from data source, add data source. Say so next, next. Let's go for our connection. I choose my server name developer. Then here we need Northwind. Let's test connection. Okay, say so next next here we need only uh, category id and name and finish as you see that it already set it like a display member category name and value member category id let's run it how it is functioning as you see that we have all here this is with the database you can bind but usually we write our codes here either radio.net or entity framework because we don't directly do bind like this because in this way it's very easy uh, anyway guys thanks for watching see you next one